All right. It's 2.31 a.m. in the morning, so I'm going to do a collection update and don't want to waste time. So to start, got two Metallica singles. Mama said, and it's, yeah, we know it's off the load album and that, that album's been shit on, but I love the load album and the song Mama said, that has real passion. So I'm glad to have these singles. I'll let you, oh. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. I'm going to adjust the lamp, so. Ay, ay, ay. There. Now you can see. <laughs> All right, and okay. All right, and two by the band Exumer. Got a good deal on both of them. They're on sale at Discogs. Zion's Gate. Great deals. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. The Raging Tides. And this album is called Fire of Damnation. Okay. Next, a band I'd heard a lot about off and on over the years. And then I finally checked them out and liked them. So finally, got an album by In Flames, Colony. And I have a second In Flames album. I'll be showing that in a little bit. But <clears throat> anyhow, next album, Necrophobic. <laughs> I mean, look at this album. The cover. I mean, no way is no way was that a bad choice. No way. Here, and this is a thrash band called Whiplash. Insult to injury. And it contains live bonus tracks. From 1986. So. <laughs> I am looking forward to. A 86 thrash metal. If you don't love the 80's. Get off my channel. <laughs> Alright. Next one. Ara Nor. And I look forward to this one. This next band, I'm so glad to have an album by them, finally. It's a band called Malevolent Creation. Oh yeah, I can't wait to spin this one. And the next album is by another band that I'm so glad to finally own something by. The band is Sodom. And... We've all heard of Sodom, plain and simple. Now, next. Oh, that fucking fan light, the glare. Anyhow, next is by a band called Aeon. I saw them open for Cannibal Corpse. Caught the bass player's guitar pick. <laughs> so, maybe I'll show that. I should show that in another video, but. For now, I want to get through the collection. Alright, and this is called Path of Fire. Here's another one by Ara Noor. 
Oh, don't you like this album cover? Okay, and here's the other In Flames album that I ordered. Reroute to Remain. Okay, and this is a band called Alga... Alga Jant... Here. Tell you what. Let me get a closer look here. Yep. Alga Jant. Eight Coffin Nails. And that's a band that I've not seen anyone talk about on YouTube, or I'm sure few of people have heard of it, so I just might do an album review on that, on them. Okay, and before I sign off, I have two vinyls by two great bands. One moment. Okay. Okay. First is Sabbath, Bloody Sabbath, Gatefold. My favorite Sabbath album. <laughs> okay. And this is a 1973 original press made in Germany. And I am proud to own this one. <laughs> and here's another one that I've dreamed of owning for so long. Motley Crue's Shot at the Devil. Seems the record itself fell out. <laughs> Not good, but anyhow. This album was released September 26, 1983. And again, this is one of the original pressings. Um, often, it was re released a year before I started kindergarten. There were times I wondered what my life would have been like had I been 16 or older back in 1983. And owning that album. And, uh, well, let me see if I can get this back in the sleeve. All right. I'll tell you what. <laughs> it fits in the gatefold, so I'll leave it at that. All right. Well, those two vinyls are treasures. Practically holy grails. I mean, not that they're not rare, but, you know. All right, and that will conclude my quick update video. And uh, see you all next time.